Okay. Got rid of everything. Only two new things. I did get shoulders, which I do get at level 11. Of course, they're not the best shoulders for me, but I don't really feel the need to make multiple attempts at it, trying to find the best one for me, even though that is what you're supposed to do with him, I think, or at least a little bit. I think it's kind of a waste. And I also got a heater shield for the Templar. Uh, plus vitality, regenerate life. Plus chance to block, you know, definitely better than what he had, which was 50. Now it's up to 88. Okay, ready to move on. We're going to the Fields of Misery once more. And this time we need to head up and to the right. I do try to get through this in one sitting, the, the Fields of Misery. It is rather large, you but... You and I aren't so different. I have great power within me, too. The only difference is I have no control over mine. Yeah, whatever you said. sounds troubling. It's only happened a few times in my life, and only when I was in grave danger. Something rises up from deep within me, and, well, I can't really explain it. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. I, I, I like doing this all at once because I don't have to clear out the, the fields of misery twice. It is quite exhausting. Oh, I almost missed the stolen sack with the scoundrel's journal in it. After much searching, I have found a promising lead. A family near New Tristram has obtained a valuable relic, and poor fools that they are, they haven't the slightest idea what to do with it. I have some idea of what to do with their daughter, though. <laughs> and through her, I'll get my prize. Speaking of the scoundrel, here he is. You there, please help. They're going to kill my friend. He is called the scoundrel. Thieves are going to kill my friend if we don't do something. Help me break these bonds and see for yourself. What do they want with your friend? She's just a farmer's daughter, Sasha, but she has a relic that the thieves are after. He's deserted you. Just give it over. I'll never tell you. Honestly, I don't think we have a choice in this. <laughs> Obviously, he's trying to steal something. Keep digging. Find that damn relic. Release the girl. The relic belongs to her. You actually believe what this scoundrel tells you? Fine, you fools. We'll kill the both of you. Yeah, no choice. So everybody must die. <laughs> it's not like they're that tall. Oh, shit, there's more. Still not that tall. There are a lot of them, though. Oh, and... Nigel Cutthroat! Oh, he's a teleporter? Nah, uh, he's a Thieves Guild Assassin! Which apparently means teleport. Get over here so I can kill you. <laughs> this isn't over. The rest of the Thieves Guild will find you. Bring it. Nothing that great for me, but I'll take everything you drop. Get some experience for that. Get a little bit of gold. How you doing, scoundrel? Here's the relic, my love. I hid it like you asked. Father's grown suspicious of us. But that won't matter once we're married. It won't be long, right? Of course, my dear. Soon we will settle down to a quiet life of tilling the fields and raising brats, uh, children. But first, I have to sell this relic. Alas, I must travel away with my friend here to do so. Wait, what? You wish to join me? Yes, yes! You look like you know a lot about markets. Now, lead the way! Yes, because I scream, traitor, don't I? Wait, the relic is a fake! Gods, I should have known! You seem like you could use a helping hand, and I sure as hell don't want to stay around here. Please tell me that you're not considering this criminal's proposal. I am. To be honest, I don't think I have a choice. <laughs> Once again, I don't think I have a choice. The Drowned Temple, you say, though. Ah, there you are. How you doing, buddy? What of your betrothed? Yeah, what of her? <laughs> Do I look like the marrying kind to you? By the way, my name is Lyndon. Uh, no. I'm gonna keep the Templar. Scoundrel, I'm not a big fan of the... Uh, he's, yeah, bows. I'd rather have the one-handed things. Yeah. No, we're good. What the tomes say of Alaric and this temple is not encouraging. Alaric's down there waiting for us. 
I don't think there's anything else here, but let me just double check. Oh, there's a way to... Oh, there's a way. It looks like there's a way further on, but there's nothing we can do just yet. Maybe he'll open up a path for us. You must be Alaric the Guardian. Uncle Decker told me of your eternal watch over this cursed place. I thought it was a myth. Are you Nephilim? Mm -hmm. No. No. There have been no Nephilim for a millennium. <laughs> Yet another myth. You seek entrance to this temple, but only a Nephilim can enter. If you retrieve the keys from the outlying tombs and use them on the gates, we will see who and what you truly are. Follow me. I will raise the bridge that you may pass. Yeah, he does open it. Uh, Nephilim are the uh, children of angels and demons. Seek two tombs in the woods beyond. The warriors rest in the crypt of the ancients. Within them reside the keys to our sacred temple. I don't know how you're supposed to know that. I remember looking it up. I want to say it's like literally between angels and demons. Like an angel and a demon have a baby together. Uh, beacon in honor of honor and beacon of light from two different dungeons, it looks like. A pall of ancient doom hangs upon these woods. These woods are ancient. They're Don't old. Don't worry about me. I won't. People? These are mongrels. God. Repel them, my brothers! What the hell? But the, listen to that. Mules are stronger than most risen dead, but they gain their fortitude through horrific means, feasting upon human corpses. These creatures are least dangerous. Uncle Deckard called these flying creatures death with wings. Are you kidding me? Shut up, Leah. Mules are stronger than most risen dead. What the hell? Nobody wants to listen to Deckard. These creatures are least dangerous while eating, but do not disturb them, or it shall be your limbs between their teeth. That is the best Deckard impression that you know of. Admit it. Yeah, that's probably the worst thing that I could ever do. But we're going to move on. They wouldn't let him finish. What the hell kind of crap was that? And, jeez, this place is going to be huge, isn't it? At least I have found a, an end. I just I don't even have time to read what their names are. I'm just absolutely destroying them too quickly. Here's a chest though. I'll take gold. Well that was that was worthwhile. Way to build my hopes up over nothing. What do we have here? We have the Crypt of the Ancients. So we will head down there. There are two places for us to go, so I'll head down one and then we'll fully explore it and then we'll head down the other. Sounds like a plan to me. That was all of them. No, I'm sure there's more somewhere. Let's head into the crypt, though. Really? There's just more of these guys? The tomb guardians and all that? Level 12. Very nice. Level 12. Uh, ground Stomp Rune. I will take it. Deafening Crush. Seismic Slam, active skill. Not exactly sure which one that one is. I think it's a right click, and I think I like it. But I haven't had time to check yet. It's just one long-ass trail of enemies right now. Can, can I have a little bit of time here? 51 monsters killed in a row. That is pretty damn sweet. Okay, can I go back here? Okay. Fine. Now I can check what I, what I pick up. Crap. Crap. And crap. Did I already throw that one out? Okay. Skills. New secondary. Templar, are there women in your order? Well, no. Shouldn't the Templar welcome anyone who wishes to fight evil? That is a fascinating idea. I will mention it to the leaders. I do like Seismic Slam. So we were switching over to that instead of the hammer. So we are done with hammer. Ground Stomp. Uh, now it'll slow enemy movement when using Ground Stomp. Remember... Which one do I like? That one. That's the one I'm waiting for. We'll get there, though. We will get there. 
Right now, we will just do what that said. Which I've already forgotten. Oh, you, you guys lured him up here. Nice job. Not really. Boom. Boom. Ha. Oh, you teleporting bitch. Get over here. Die. Not really. Just a couple earthquakes knocked him out. So, I don't want to spoil too much, but the, the guy pretty much... Oh, journal! We were so sure we could beat whatever traps the ancients had laid for tomb robbers. But the dead bodies of my friends testify to the folly of our arrogance. I will be dead soon as well. Our greed was our downfall. So... There was a name that was brought up, and it's Nephilim, and from what I remember, they don't really talk about what that means. You're just supposed to look it up, which is why I, I mentioned what it was. It's pretty much the first humans, which are, uh, from what I remember, it was it was an angel and a demon having a kid together. Uh, that That's what a Nephilim is, and that's why they haven't been away, uh, around for a long time. It's like the first humans. But they said that only a Nephilim could go in there. But we could prove ourselves to be a Nephilim by going in here. Alright, one beacon down, I guess. I, I was kind of expecting more, but I will take what, what you will give me. Uh, level 12, so once again, when we go back to town, I'll probably have some new stuff to craft. Hopefully something better than what I got. That shield is huge on you, Templar. Uh, the scoundrel, yeah, he uses bows. He's he's a follower just like the Templar. Should you choose him, you'll have to leave the Templar behind. Uh, I might go over his skills, how I would build him, and then leave him um, back in town, which is where he's waiting for me. And you can talk to him while he's in town, you know, sh should you desire. But once again, the, the followers, I never do. The followers is, is is too much dialogue. The, you know, Deckard, Leah, the stranger, those are the ones that I'm focusing on. They're plot important. Templar and Scoundrel are not, so that's the way I'm going to have to look at it. Let's continue exploring all the way around. Hopefully we can find the other place soon. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't let you finish. Everything must die. That's that's the end of the story. I think he said he was trying to hold us back from the temple. It's not going to work. I'm too powerful for that. Ambushed by the spirits of the dead. Oh no! Our lives will be ours. No, no. Like we were ambushed, and then I like I swung once, and there went half of their pincer attack. It was awesome. I love how overpowered I am. And it, yeah, it's not necessarily on purpose, but that you know, next time we come through here, which will be on the hardest difficulty, I will not be this overpowered. And I'll probably have to run from pincer tracks and things like that. But as for now, I am happy the way that things are. I spent years exploring places like this for a this brings back memories. Oh, good for you. I enjoy hunting in those creatures through strange new lands. I was talking about happy memories. As well. My people defy you! That is weird that these guys have, I don't know, like, speaking priority over everything else. Over the journals, over my companions, over anything I say. These guys, their, their stuff gets said first and, and foremost and that's weird to me oh shit return to archers hey I stunned him and then I ran away how about that how about you eat some of that huh I can get three of those off if I'm full ooh another ring what do we get gold oh and then plus damage that's pretty cool I guess and nothing just thought I would check. Hopefully I can get better rings, though. Usually the rings are where you can get some good stuff. At least that's how it was before. In Diablo 2. So hopefully they carried that over to Diablo 3, where it's 
it's the rings that give you some massive bonuses. That and the amulet, but I, don't, I haven't found anything to put around my neck just yet. God, this place is huge! Everything's huge. Where, where are you going to? Every die. The light grows. Once again, metaphorically. Because there's nothing... Oh, there's a waypoint here. Boom. The light does glow. Grow. Did you see that grow? What are you guys doing down there? I don't think I can attack them. Once again, they, they add a lot of detail. I mean, look down there. Look at all that detail. And it shows that I actually could attack them. But I have no way, no means of doing that. I like that. I like that they add things that you can't interact with. Oh. I can interact with that one. And she's luring more out. So there we go. You can interact with at least two of them. But there was one way down there. That I assume there's nothing you could do with. Where's the other one? There it is. This is our next destination. Into the Warrior's Rest. They are dungeons. I swear there was an event here. But didn't show up for me this time. Too bad. Tell me about Warrior's Rest. Eric says that our people can survive the coming battle. But I saw the truth in his eyes. Why did he order me to guard the beacon of honor? Those shambling things are slaughtering my people in the forest above, and there's nothing I can do to stop it. Not enough fury. Did he did he finish? I think he did. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was a little busy focusing on earthquakes and that kind of thing. They dropped Mending Wanderer hat. I was hoping that'd be a sickle. The sickles are awesome. I don't mean to keep the sickles on purpose, but they're the best things that I can come across. Oh, that's right. The men, the Wanderer hat. Templar, is. I think I saw you at an inn several months ago. Uh, that is likely. I have journeyed a long way. You were extremely polite, but tipped poorly, I am told. That's him. You should pick up the pace. That's him, all right. Done. Place the beacons on the pedestal, so we gotta go back the way that we came. Uh, unfortunately, that does mean a little bit of walking. Fortunately, this place was really freaking small. <laughs> there was not that much here, so back out to the festering woods. And back the way that we came. I don't think there's gonna be anything more here. Once again, we have cleared everything out. Oh, that's the way that I like it. Giant empty fields, because I have done my job until I reload the game. Then I have not done my job at all, and the place looks very, very different. But that's neither here nor there. We'll just continue on. So, I guess I should talk a little bit about the arena that we had at uh, BlizzCon. Uh, from what I understand, it, I don't see that big of a difference between what they're talking about with the duels in the arena, uh, but they definitely said they were going to cancel the arena. Uh, the arena was like four on four, uh, but the problem was that they said they couldn't balance it, and that's, that was our concern, too. Um, it actually took <laughs> a really good barbarian to figure out how to play barbarian for a long time. It was just mages and uh, wizards, I should say, and uh, witch doctors in there. There. Put it, yes, put it on the pedestal. And, there, yeah, we still couldn't really find a use for a demon hunter in the arena, to be honest with you. So it's not surprising that they that they ended up abandoning it, but it is sad that they did. All right, Drown Temple. You have anything to say about this? The temple is open. Enter and defeat the guardians within. Although they are my brothers, they will seek your death when you enter. I cannot fault them for doing their duty. I can. I'll kill them for it. Into the Drown Temple we go. Look at this architecture. This predates the Sin War. Predates the Sin War? That is friggin' old! And how how would you be able to tell that? Yeah, they mention a lot of stuff that you might not know, like the Sin War. They did oh, explain no, that don't. a little bit. But not too much. Ezek! None may enter the inner sanctum. I think I missed him with a couple of those earthquakes. Oh, he's not going to let me finish him until he's done with that. 
And we got Brother Moek, Brother Laryl. Oh, shit. All right, let's kill these guys. These guys are fucking the crap on me. There we go. Stun you. Damn it, it went the wrong way again. Where the hell were the other things? Ow. Alaric. I'm gonna need some help here. I think. Nope. Hold on. I, I, I need help in a second. The world stone has been changed. World stone. Our children are born weak and suffer short lives. The demon Nereza promised to restore their power, but instead turned them into misshapen creatures and sent them to war against us. We may die, but not before she is sent back to the burning hells. That does not sound that great. Your strength rivals that of our greatest champions. What now do you think you are? You may enter our most sacred place. The spirit speaks the truth. This was a good place. I can feel it. So I'm just as powerful as the strongest words. Fought his way here just to die. Magda. Magda. And who is this you bring with you? Adria's daughter? She has power within her. What does that mean? Your mother will soon share your fate with you. The shard is mine. Wait. Fill this temple with their blood. Done. What did she mean? My mother will share my fate. Right. Could my mother be alive after all these years? No way. She's full of lies. Do not believe her. Don't trust the butterfly. And what is the power within you that she spoke of? This fight was too easy. She's toying with us. We must get back to Uncle Deckard right away. All right. Let's grab the shard. And then return the glowing shard to Tristan. I think the town portal is the best way to do that. We are done here. I don't want to run back. So, why didn't I do this before? That would have been a lot smarter of me. Oh, we have to talk to the stranger first, do we? So then I'm going to talk to Deckard. I have to say about the World Stone. The World Stone was an ancient artifact of immense power. It was used not only to create our world, but also to control mankind. The original humans were known as the Nephilim, and their power was such that it was feared they would tip the balance in the eternal conflict between the high heavens and the burning hells. So the World Stone was tuned to lessen our powers, turning mankind into what we are today. But now that it has been destroyed, it is conceivable that the powers of the Nephilim will reappear. Interesting. That is a justification that I did not hear before. 